Come here often? Yeah. <laughs> So we offer occupational therapy, speech therapy, physical therapy, and feeding therapy for special needs populations ages zero to 21. Our kiddos have been to doctors and doctors. Some of them have genetic anomalies, some of them have sensory issues. And so whenever they come to a, a physician's office, they always have that fear of shots or just the unexpected. Um, so we definitely wanted to build something that was like more of a home environment and so when they came in they automatically knew that this was different that this was a place for fun so each of our rooms are very colorful we have theme rooms um, and then we have big fun sensory rooms where they feel like they're just playing but we know that we're getting therapeutic needs met and so it's kind of a win-win for everybody We've had parents say that I've been to this therapy clinic for three years and we've achieved more in three months here than we were able to at the other offices. Um, we have a hard time getting our kiddos to leave. Um, they love it here. <laughs> we know we're not normal, but we're the, we're the friends that you make movies about. We received an email. Right. And it said, please call us about this, the SBA award. And then when they announced person of the year, we were kind of like, huh, we just stared at each other. For and a minute. I think my mouth was like all the way open on the ground. And then we acted cool because it played off like yeah. cool. Like this yeah. is not what I expected. All right, all right. Thank yeah. you so much for this honor. We really appreciate that. We got the phone and we started screaming and jumping down. And we were crying. It was just like a really great honor. Yeah. But to be nominated and, and awarded the persons of the year we're just so thankful um, for yeah. the whole SBA and the, the council whoever decided for us we're, we're just so grateful. The score is going to help us tremendously in the future. It really helps people like us who are operating on a dream and a budget to have access to thousands of mentors who are in your area of expertise and who are just really trying to make the world a better place than they left it which aligns with Amber and I's beliefs. I really hope there's inspiration for other people to do the same thing we have done. Take a leap of faith. Take a leap of faith, you know. I think that it's so overwhelming, the idea of putting your entire life on the line to start a business, and you don't know how to do that. You don't know where to start. You can think, we totally thought we knew. We did not know mm -hmm. about what <laughs> we are going to experience. Um, but just trusting your gut, you know, you dream big. 